And we are underway in Val de Sole. Look at Schwarzbauer, Bosch and Rue beside him. Schwarzbauer, the fastest starter now. There he is, Schwarz leading in the first corner. Schwarzbauer, like a motocross bike, leaving a trail <laughs> off the start line as he digs another furrow in this field in Val de Sole. Look at him go. Every battle stroke in the first few hundred meters are right there. Joshua Dubow in the dark blue yeah. top of the number eight alongside him. Jordan Saru, the winner for the last time out, the number one BMC alongside him. Daskali, Martin Bloom is also a little bit further down. Simon Andreas uh, here. Andreas is not looking happy at the back of here. Total pile up on the way in through the tunnel now. It's that easy for these riders, even if it's only the best 40 riders of the world. Now watch for action here as they hit on this rock garden. Josh Cross is saying very little traction available here. The world's best making good sense with though. As Jens Sherman's bubbles a bit. Chasing group, small gap to the first group. Of course, really cutting up now as well, so La Rutz will start to form. Jordan Saru on the Team BMC bike with that Oulin suspension. Josh Redibo now leading this group. Dubo, one of the standout acts of 2023 so far. Nearly took victory in the Olympic distance in Nova Meso Namarave behind Tom Pidcock, but really, really impressing. And moving to the front now, Schwarzbauer letting him as well. Yeah, probably these riders in front, they will slow down a little bit, and for the rest it's difficult to find their positions, their lines. Haverly and... off. Haverly just having the tripod his way up there slightly, foot on clips. And from Cooper, New Zealand. He's in 20 of the our time yeah. in screens. Last split time he was. Schwarzbauer then. The head rocking and rolling. Dubot likes that left-hand line on the way back down towards the arena. Sam Gaze, though, in those blue sunglasses, shirt, slotting in behind Nino shirt, or looking ominous, the world champion in the number 29. Sam Gaze, uh, he didn't do the rounds in uh, Leogang, even last week. Uh, of course, European Championship was not for him. So uh, he must be a little bit fresh. It's just a case of getting churned up by the racers, it's really doing the damage. The is still high in the front. Yeah, of the it's a matter of time now before we see a, a real attack of one of the riders. And across the finish line, two more laps to go, and we normally that's the time to uh, put the hammer down to find the, uh, the, the final positions the from there. Uh, the, UK's, sprint. the UK's Charlie Aldridge has the fastest lap at the minute, just ahead of Avancini. Impressive uh, on such a young age performing uh, so good in short track racing. Yeah, the European short track champion. Small gap. There is Gears just giving himself a bit of room. Flugiger in the red, the head rolling on the number seven. Jordan Suru, BMC rider now with the number one coming to the front. The overall points leader in the short track, Jordan Saru on the right hand side, but it's Lucas Schwarzbauer who leads him in that right hander for the final lap now. Matthias Flugiger now on third place, and Marcus Blum is one of the last riders here of this leading group. It comes down to a sprint. Yeah, look back over the shoulder. Yeah, Dubo joins Schwarzbauer at the front of this one. Just these long off camber turns now. Here's Sam Gase. Jordan Saru. It looks like these two could be contesting on a sprint finish yeah, here in here, Italy. Here for more, Alan Hertley, Jan Schuermans, that are uh, the top three chasing hard. Schwarzbauer, Schwarzbauer kicks. Schwarzbauer goes, he's not hanging around, he doesn't want to take it to the line, he wants to start a sprint now. The horsepower of Lukas Schwarzbauer. Well, we've used it before, but whatever the German for horsepower is, it could well be Schwarzbauer as he rounds the right-hander, Lukas Schwarzbauer for the Canyon Collective. It looks like Hatterley now is coming to Joshua Di Bose, bringing for the second place. Schwarzbauer takes them down the line, and look at the celebration, he knows how good a performance that is. Lukas Schwarzbauer takes the win in Val de Sole ahead of Alan Haverley from Joshua Dubot, from Pierre de Foimont, from Jens Sherman's, Blevin, Saru, Flugiger, Gaze, and Scherter, home in 10. I'm joined by Lucas Schwarzbauer, winner of this cross country short track. I mean, that was a masterclass in how to win a race on the final lap. Yeah, I am. I was pretty surprised that I've been so strong. I mean, I'm in good shape, that's for sure, but I also felt really tired. Uh, I did the Europeans last week, uh, it was a big travel, and um, yeah, I was just hoping that I can conserve my legs uh, one more time, and yeah, today I think tactically I did it perfect, uh, a bit, yeah, thank you to Nino, who made a good lead out for me, but I think in the end I was the strongest, this course really suits me, it has one really hard kick, but also some flat, flat sections, 
so yeah, yeah, crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah just, just catch my third uh, World Cup. Cup. Yeah, so yeah. happy. Yeah. Get ready for the smile here. It comes in for Canyon Collective and for Germany. Lucas Schwarzbauer. What a 2023 season this man is having. Schwartz Bar takes victory in Val de Sole, Trentino. Schwartz Bar from Haverly, from Dubo. Your top three, the UCI. As the rain continues to fall in Val de Sole. Schwartz Bar, Haverly, Dubo, De Farmont, Jens Sherman's in fifth. Levin, Saru, Flugiger, Gaze, and Nino Scherter in 10th. Seven seconds covering the top 10. That's how close it was. Martins, Blooms, Brado, Alban, Forster, Grio, Brado, Litcher, Fidare, Marat, Sink, Valero Serrano, Garini, Dascalu, Rom, Vavak, Cooper, Andreasen, and Zanotti. Charlie Aldridge back in 30th, then just behind Avancini. Here's confirmation then off the standings. Schwartz Bar from Saru by 180 points at the front. There's Debo Sherman's Flukiger, Havili, Brido, Scherter, Blooms, and Brido. And really, yeah, Saru, Schwartz Bar emerging at the halfway point of the season to be what looks like being the defining battle. Sam Gaze is 11th, ahead of Lars Forster in 12th, Pierre de Foimont in 13th. Blevins back in 21st, ahead of Piscalu. 